sure if it's like the most popular one. I think it might be like the most popular Canadian cover.
magical flying car. No note. <laughs> Back at Hogwarts School of Witchcraft, 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 and Wizardry for his second year, Harry hears strange whispers echo through empty corridors, and then the attacks start. Students are found as though turned to stone. Dobby's sinister predictions seem to be coming true. And this pack has little Dobby on it. It's so cute. Alright, let's read our page. Page 126. The minutes snailed by. Harry let Lockhart's voice wash over him, occasionally saying, one is 
the string and inserted it into his ears as the twins had done. What? Oh, okay, go, Fred whispered. The flesh-colored strings wiggled like long skinny worms and snaked under the door. At first, Harry could hear nothing. Then he jumped as he heard, as he heard Donks whispering as clearly as though she were standing right beside him.
out of my book. It's a little, um, I used it as a bookmark, and it's a little like, you know how they had wizarding collecting cards, um, that you'd get, like, with your chocolate frog. I got one somewhere. I don't know where, but it was a chocolate frog, and it came with a little card, and it's Hagrid. And it's a little, like, moving one. Oh, I totally forgot about this. And it's a little dragon. <laughs> Robius, Hagrid, keeper of keys and grounds at Hogwarts. A Gryffindor when a student at Hogwarts. He is almost twice as tall as a normal man and at least five times as wide. With long tangles of bushy black hair and a beard that hides most of his face. His hands are the size of trash can lids and his feet in their leather boots are like baby dolphins. Albus Dumbledore has said that he would trust Hagrid with his life.